you know, just a little octopus swimming through the ocean, minding my own business when there's submarines that are coming into attack. Thankfully, we have tentacles that they just swim into so we can just bat them away. And then we stay nice and safe. And then they send in some faster submarines, which thankfully go down just as easily. And they also drop money occasionally. Oh, huge wave of enemies is approaching. We got this. And they're sending more of the fast ones. I like this. Give me more money. You didn't give me money. Ooh, but there's a shell thing there. Just gotta hopefully... Yes, we did it. And we get more money so we can buy some upgrades for our octopus like an extra tentacle and then we can put a crab claw on one of those because that should be good i like me a crab claw that gives the big pinchy pinchy just gotta wait for him to swim close and pinch oh but i was uh oh, okay i got distracted there you need to keep the other submarines at bay wow i guess crab claws aren't everything and what is that is that a nuke submarine oh wait come here you oh no i didn't get the health back that's okay. I'll just get rid of the rest of these enemies before they get too close. And of course, the first thing they send is a nuke because that's a great idea. Okay, I need to manage what tentacles are attacking what enemies. Oh no, this is not looking very good. I need the shells till I can end level. Wow, -wee, that was rough. Maybe we need some range damage. So let's get a snake head right there and maybe another tentacle just so we can another. even things out. Our octopus is already looking very weird. Ooh, more health. I need you. Yes, I got the health. Okay, we're in this for a little bit longer then. Oh, that snake shot is so good. Can you send another health submarine, please? And not one of those big ones. Oh, gosh. Ow. Ooh, the crab claw takes away those big submarines right away. I like it. A large enemy approaching. Oh, I don't like this. Uh, Hello? what is that? Is that a frog? No, it's just a fish thing. Hey, why don't you come here closer so I can pinch you with the claws and keep your little piranha babies away from me. I don't like that very much. Ooh, crab claw does big damage there. I like it. Yes, just bash him some more. Let's get a little closer. Come on, a little closer. There it is. And then pinch again. Yes, gain some good damage on him. Oh, yes, he's destroyed some more. And pinch. And pinch. Yes, we got him. Fall to the ocean floor, you stupid fish thing. And we got a lot of money from that. Ooh, a cobra. Shoots venom faster. Oh, I could go for one of these. Slap you on here instead of the other snake. And we can get a penguin too, which should freeze the enemies. Ugh, we're on the land now. What even is this thing? The penguin is so confused looking, but he shoots really fast so he can freeze things. And now we have to tear down the building so we can progress. Oh, and I guess they're launching planes at us. Well then. At least one of them gave us health. And this cobra shoots so fast. I love it. Just gotta be careful of that nuke truck behind us. Maybe I can freeze it and then move on with my day. Just gotta keep rolling forward. And there's a nuke truck in front of us now. So let's just pinch you and get rid of you. And get some health back. Some more health, please. Yes. Whoa, that's a big plane rolling in. I don't even know where they get these things. But hopefully the crab claw can just pinch it away safely. Yes, they can. And then we'll freeze you and shoot you with the venom. And that went down super quick. Very nice. So we'll tear down the building a little more while keeping everything at bay. Oh, now we got a huge wave of enemies approaching. This is not good. And that big truck is rolling in. Okay, move out of the way of that. Very easy. And even though there's lots of enemies, the penguin is able to freeze them, which keeps them at bay very effectively. Oh, I would love to blow one of them up with the nuke truck. We'll freeze you so the truck can catch up and then probably just blow up the rest of you really quickly. I'm not sure how long I should stick around here. They're starting to close in quite a bit and blow them up. Yes, we blew up two of them with the nuke truck. Very good. Those got taken care of very effectively. I think we're okay. And now we just have more regular planes coming in. That's no problem at all. Let's just roll past this plane so he flies upside down. Aw, he flipped over. That's fine. We'll just roll past you as well. And ooh, some shells in this building. Let's just get you torn down quickly. Maybe get rid of the planes that are tailing behind me here. And just pinch the building some more so more damage gets done. Come on, destroy it. Yes. Now just keep everything else away. We did it. And since we're here, we might as well get some projectile damage on the other side of our octopus. Even though it's not the cobra, it should do really good. Especially against these smaller planes that it can still one shot. And we'll just keep the cobra pointed at the fast plane that comes in. And nothing can really get to us. I like this. All of these fast planes stacked up. Can't even get close to my octopus. And we should have plenty of money after this level is over to get some nice upgrades. And some top off health while we're at it. And blow up the plane. Yes. Oh boy, more fast planes coming in. Bomb them some. Yes. 
Yes, we got them all. And the Clarab Claw is great for taking out buildings, but that truck is getting a little close, so go away. A huge wave of enemies approaching again. Question is, where are they though? Oh, it's another shell building. I think I'll just start working on destroying this. And the truck is on the wrong side of the building, but there's two of them there. Thankfully, they're not a threat. And I can just go ahead and destroy this building like I was going to. Just a few more hits, I think. And also keeping everything away like that. Yes, we got it. Just in time too. Ooh, and a lobster claw for very high damage. We could get that to replace the crab claw. And now we're at our mission location to destroy the Statue of Liberty. Keeping very high damage focused in the front where all the dangerous things are. And these buildings are getting taller too. I wonder if that means they have more health. That doesn't matter. The lobster claw will just tear right through them. And it can attack very fast too, which is good because ow, we got hit by a plane. No worries though. We clear out everybody and we move on. Warning, huge enemy the butcher is approaching. What is this? Hi, how are you? Uh, oh, I guess that's the butcher and he's got a hammer thing. Okay. Oh, fresh me. You just sound weird. I'm going to pinch your eyeball. Where is that flying in from? Oh, right there. Uh, gotta stay safe. That's okay. We have him on the retreat, which is good news for us. Oh gosh, get out of the way. Oh, this guy is dangerous. We need to take him out quickly. Just keep him rolling backwards. This is working good for us. Freeze him a bit. Oh, that doesn't do anything. He doesn't stay frozen very long. Just get in range of my lobster claw so I can do even more damage to you. Yes, that's working. Uh-oh, uh three of them. Oh, stay safe. Woo! Very small safety window there. And now we just go back to shooting Venom right in his eyeballs. Or eyeball. He only has one. Not much more you can do here, buddy. I didn't even have to move for that one. Wow. Now I can pinch him in the eye with the claw again. Now he has planes coming in for support. A lot of good they're gonna do. I have attacks going on all directions. Just a little bit more of this. Just shooting the venom straight to the eyes and the butcher is taken out. Yes, very good. He doesn't blow up, right? Maybe he does. Oh, ooh, oh. Okay, he blew up all of them. I'm okay with this. Got quite a bit of money from him too. Now we can go all the way to the Statue of Liberty and just start tearing it down and chomp. Yes, there is nothing that can stop me from ultimate destruction. In a video game, of course. FBI agent, if you're watching, this is just a game. Ooh, an egg? What do we do with this? Oh, we got a little pet puffer fish. Press both left and right to puff. Oh, look at this. We have friends. Uh, electric friends. I don't know if I like this. Press both left and right to puff. Whoa, okay. We just gotta stay safe while collecting all the shells that we can. And our poor little guy's looking very tired. Oh, gotta stay safe. I don't know who's dropping all these depth charges and electric things. Oh, no. Oh, but he has his puff energy back, so that's a good thing. I don't really want to use it if I don't need to, though. And this is getting very dangerous. Oh, boy. Obstacle path of death charges. Ooh, we made it through. And we get a bee. Shoots homing bees. Oh, I like this. Can I see it? Yes, I can. Okay, we have a lot of money, so we can... Oh, we could get a puffer fish. That's okay. We'll just add a tentacle uh, right here, I think. And then we can put a bee on there. Ooh, and the homing bee is very effective in this new area against the new enemies. But I tell you what, I think I'll save this for another video if you guys want to watch that. So thank you guys for watching this one. And let me know if you want to see more Octageddon. Sub to intern. I'd also like to thank the channel members, including Bread, Mr. Cripple One, Ancient Elixir One, Corby Farm, Bladed Archer, Dakota C, Donamoto, Deviant X, Muffin Stuffer, Lucas S, Ali B, Splatter Sacks, The Real Nickname, Edward, Hateful Herald, Todd M, and Peggy Sue.